Leafy is here has been a very much so, guys, controversial channel to say the least. And Leafy has been a very controversial figure in the YouTube space and even on Twitch as well. And I wanted to talk, guys, about will Leafy is here return back to YouTube or to Twitch or where at some point or another in the future. So let's talk about it. So, guys, Leafy is here. I I've, I've said this many times on the YouTube channel. We've made Leafy is here content on the channel, and you guys can check out all of that here but that being said I actually you know in the early days of Leafy's channel I really enjoyed his content he was very funny I thought there was just you know a lot of his videos were, were clever creative he had some interesting commentaries um, but obviously it seemed that over time he got into a lot of the cyberbullying he kind of got people to you know start going to other streamers, uh, you know, other streamer streams and, you know, kind of giving a lot of hateful, uh, you know, kind of conduct and things of that nature, almost just going over the top. And that being said, I always felt though that that was part of Leafy's identity. He just kind of got to a point where there were things that bothered him about YouTube and about just the different platforms. And that was something that he spoke about. He just was open about it. He didn't really care so much about, you know, policies and things of that nature from YouTube or Twitch. And obviously it's resulted, of course, in his permanent ban on YouTube. So obviously guys, his channel um, is gone on YouTube. And if you go to to, uh, his Wikipedia page. So obviously, guys, um, beginning in 2016, Vale was involved in several conflicts with other YouTubers, which led to allegations of cyberbullying. Vale was permanently banned by YouTube in 2020, citing repeated violations of their harassment policies. And so that being said, um, uh, Calvin Vale uh, is Leafy's name, uh, obviously got, you know, banned. And so the question is, is could this be something that could ever be reversed where they allow him to come back? In my opinion, guys, when you talk about a permanent ban, I think it's pretty hard to believe that YouTube would allow him back on the platform. Even if he tried to start a new YouTube channel and everything, it would be it would be shut down very quickly, I believe. Now, the question then is, is what about Twitch and other platforms? So, Obviously, guys, Leafy is here. His channel was a drama commentary and story time channel. Leafy is here mainly commented on gossip involving online content creators and made videos telling life stories. In 2016, YouTuber iDubs featured Leafy in an episode of his content cop series accusing him and his videos of cyberbullying, among other criticisms. Um... Now, in 2019, iDub's video criticizing Vale was taken down after it was determined to be in violation of YouTube's guidelines. So, that was a really interesting, you know, kind of turn of events. And then on August 21st, 2020, Vale's YouTube account was permanently terminated. According to The Verge, Vale's channel had three violations in the previous three months, such as cyberbullying and encouraging viewers to disrupt other people's streams. A YouTube spokesperson said the channel had repeatedly violated YouTube's policies on harassment. Following the ban, Vale began streaming frequently on Twitch. He has also posted on com uh, on competing video platform Storyfire. Storyfire is no longer around, guys. He also got into conflicts with YouTuber Ethan Klein, known as H3H3. And then on September 11th, 2020, Vale's Twitch account was also banned. Earlier that day, Vale had tweeted about receiving a strike on his account from Twitch for hateful conduct and threats of violence against a person of group uh, or group of people. Twitch did not comment on the ban or indicate whether it was permanent. And so, that being said, guys, the big question here is, will Leafy return? And it's felt like there's been times where Leafy will go on very long hiatuses, but he always comes back in one capacity or another. I do believe, though, guys, that he will be in the scene one way or another, that being like on Twitter, that being Facebook, or wherever it is that he decides to go, if he wants to stream on Facebook, if he wants to go to other, you know, platforms, I'm sure, guys, that people, his following, he's got a very much so cult following of people that absolutely love his content, and they will follow him no matter where he goes. Now, before his channel was terminated, guys, he had 4.9 million subscribers. That is unbelievable to think that he amassed that big of a fan base. And the fact of the matter is, guys, is that 
I do believe that part of the reason why he got so big so quickly was because of the content that he was putting up that was controversial, right? Drama channels seem to create a lot, they get a lot of views and a lot of traction. And, you know, that being said, he definitely was one of the people at the forefront of that whole movement almost of the drama, you know, content and, you know, talking trash about other creators and what other people are doing and gossip and things of that nature. And like I said, I thought Leafy had a certain way of doing it that was really interesting and I thought very creative at times, but I felt that he just went over the top too many times and obviously YouTube with the way they've changed over the years um, and their policies, you know, wanting it to be more family friendly, things of that nature, that definitely did not help Leafy's case. So the question is, guys, is, is he going to return? I do believe he's going to return in some capacity or another. I don't believe it'll be on YouTube and who knows if it'll ever be Twitch or some other platform, but I think he's going to be in the scene one way or another, that being like on Twitter, uh, some form of social media. So I, like I said, guys, keep your eyes open. I'm sure he's going to come back at some point or another. It just probably won't be on YouTube, but let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. Do you ever think that Leafy is here is going to return back to the forefront, whether it's on YouTube, Twitch, or another platform? Let me know. And for more content like this, guys, stay here with Zero TV.